Hi guys, Barra Princess here again with another video. So the Manchester police are investigating the circumstances surrounding a suspected case of murder-suicide at Bonito Crescent in Mandeville. Dead are Ricky Ellis, 42 years old, a former taxi driver, and wife Stephanie Ellis, 43 years old, who was said to be a loans officer at a bank in Mandeville, specifically Scotia Bank. It is believed that the couple was having marital issues. My viewers and subscribers, that I'm not sure of. However, uh, there was an interview that was done with um, Ricky's uh, former co-workers, that's taxi drivers, two taxi drivers that he worked with. I have included that snippet in, 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 in this piece. So you know what guys, take a listen, take a look and let's engage in the comment section and always remember to like share comment subscribe and hit that notification bell i came knowing ricky for many years you know he was my colleague when we used to run when i used to run taxi you know him as a very calm gentle very I decent see. person hard working I know his wife also, from she used to go to school, is a car in the taxi. And we know that they had a relationship for many years. I'm really surprised. And I can't say nothing bad about Ricky. And I can't say nothing bad about his wife. They're such wonderful couples. So I don't know what could have transpired. What could have happened? Has this come as a shock to you? It is. It's shock to the entire taxi. So the investigation hasn't finished yet, so we don't know what really happened really. So we can't say he killed his wife or whatever. We don't know what happened to the investigation. Because presently but, now, the both of them is over there in the house, like. And trust me, it's sad. It's sad because, you know, so we know Ricky long years ago in the taxi system. And we know Stephanie. And then we just hear this shocking news on the Monday, days where you turned off. January, the start in the year. Yeah, it's sad, man. It's sad, you know. It's sad. We don't really know what really transpired, but honestly, whatever. Trust me, it's sad. I heard it, man. I heard it. So, so you don't know if they have been in any risk of issues. You just know them as a little bit more. No. Because they have been together from she was. I remember she was going to um CTC and from there till now, and she just come up now and just lost her life. Everything just just blew like nothing ever happened. You got you heard it. Honestly, I, I'm not sure 100% where you which I heard that they were going probably to a little divorce situation. So I don't know if all of this act up and cause all this disaster that really happened right now. Am I just tell us your name for the record? Junior, taxi operator. And the little new green. That's the route he always operates. And your name? Oh, I'm Gary Williams. They call me Aki. And Ricky's, do you know Ricky's full name? No, you know, so we always call him Fuzzy. I think too that I don't know him, him fully. That's what we used to call him. Yeah. Uh, his nickname Fuzzy. And was he a taxi operator up, up until. Yes, man, he was a taxi operator. Yeah, he's not a well actually. He came out of the taxi system <laughs> probably about four years ago now. Mm -hmm. Can we talk? Yeah, man, he grew up his own life. And so forth. And he did look a charter the same way. Mm -hmm. He did look a charter the same way. Do you, know what, do you know what his and wife did? Huh? Do you know what his wife did for work? He worked at this Scotia Bank in Mandeville here. And I just can't imagine how the parents them feel at this moment. Nice people. Nice, nice parents nice and nice all the stuff. The girl you know? grew up in a nice woman. What age persons we talking about? Um, Ricky, 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 young, yeah, Ricky yeah. 940. And, yeah, and the girl, the young lady is born to her thirties. In Jonah? Young people. Yeah. They had children? No, not that I, Ricky, right? Ricky have, have a son. Oh, but not 